Now to the Trump presidency. President Trump announced his picks to replace key members of his administration. This morning, President Trump made up his mind on who he wants to fill the post of Attorney General and U.S. Ambassador to the U.N. CBS 4's Nicole Killian is live at the White House with the details. Nicole. Good afternoon to you, Maribel. And there had been a lot of speculation in recent days about who would fill both of these posts. But President Trump finally made it official this morning before heading out on a trip to Kansas City. President Trump has made his choice to replace Jeff Sessions as Attorney General. Bill Barr will be nominated for the United States Attorney General position. I think he will serve with great distinction. Barr has served in the position before. He was President George H.W. Bush's Attorney General from 1991 to 1993. Despite that, he is still somewhat of an outsider to the Trump administration. I did not know him for until recently when I went through the process of looking at people. And he was my first choice from day one. Barr is still seen as more of an establishment pick and will likely enjoy the full support of Senate Republicans in the upcoming confirmation process. Respected by Republicans and respected by Democrats, he will be nominated for the United States Attorney General. And hopefully that process will go very quickly. President Trump also announced he is nominating State Department spokesperson Heather Nauer to be the U.S. ambassador to the U.N. Somebody that we know very well who's done a great job at the, as, as working with Mike Pompeo and others over at the State Department. The former Fox News anchor will replace Nikki Haley, who resigned in October. And it's great for and just a short time ago, President Trump tweeted his thanks to Haley and also touted both nominations again, which so far appear to be welcomed by top Republicans on Capitol Hill. Live at the White House, Nicole Killian, CBS 4 News.